Today, I will show you how I export the FPS animation from Blender to God of War. In this project, the animation of weapon and the arm is separated, and they are safe in different directory. Yes, the rifle, and that is for weapons, and that is for the arm. To import the animations, we could export the GLTF from Blender and save the animation we need. Now we pick up the boat drag. In this example, we will export uh, animations called Reload Open Boat. The frame rate be set to 60 FPS. So we preview the animation. To export animations, we select the army track first and then generate game rig. And add the action we want to export. I add action called idle to rest because I want to explore the difference of spine. There is idle to rest. And we select the control rig and Gambrick, bake. Now we select the the camera and the marsh and export. And that is my preset when we export to God of War. Okay. Now we explore the weapon animation. And select the weapon mesh and the uh, armature. Export it. Okay, let's return to game engine. If Godot does not re-import the file automatically, do it manually. And for the setting for the file, the FPS is set to 60, the same settings in Blender. And 
The turning of the animation optimizer is hard for me for now, so we turned it off temporarily. And Sam to weapon. We check the animation. This for the arm and the weapon. After saving the animation as a resource, we load them into the animation player. As you can see, some function calls are placed on the animation track and we can copy them. Now for the arm. The animation not work because the structure is different. So Okay, that's work. Now look at the basic setup. This character. And our arm is attached to it. When the game starts, weapons we attach to right hand, left hand are the so-called animation root. The arm animation is controlled by animation tree. In the state machine, the default entry is idle. When we reload by bullet, we open the bow and repeat the reload animation. If the advanced condition is true, it will close the boat and return to idle. And that's the reload by stripper clip. And this is shoot. And this holster. And this draw. 
inspection. Dry fire. Now we look at the weapon animation. I know a reload clip. Um, reload close bow. Open bolt. A repeat. Let's us look at the script. Most of the variables have been exported. To implement complex action for the weapon, I create a function in weapon class to chain the weapon attaching. It calls attach to attach to animation root attach to right hand and left hand. The use in the core and the animation. Look at the reload function. Here we call the reload. Here I attach the weapon to the animation root and play the reload open build animation. And when we finish the reloading, when we finish the reloading, the weapon will be attached to the left hand. And that's it, how it works. Now we launch the level. Now we reload the blade. Open bolt, reload, and cross the bolt. Dry fire, and reload again. And we host the weapon and draw the weapon. <laughs> this is the inspection.